Hello YouTube, FSP here, I'm in the shed, it is a thousand degrees in here, it is hot, uh, but I wanted to get out here and organize a few things and bring you a video today, I may have mentioned this before in a live stream, but, uh, okay the scenario is, you had two years worth of food, you were a prepared patriot, but you chose to help some people. And because of that, your supplies dwindled down faster than you thought they would. So now you and your crew are out of food. There's no word on when power will be restored, utilities will be restored, still in a full-blown SHTF. It may be time to take action for the cause of your own survival. Having a good uh, kit like this can help you if you have to take matters in your own hands. And I'm not telling anybody to do that unless they're going to die without food, okay? So what we have here, lock picks. I used to work for a locksmith shop. It was 20 years ago. But uh, these are my favorite ones. That's why they're in this little pouch. This was a, uh, like, fingernails and files and clippers. That's what this pouch was. But I used it to put my set in there. My favorite set of tools is in that one. These are some spares in case I break one. Uh, also, a good set of strong nippers. Uh, chain link fences, that type of thing. You're going to need some good strong cutters. Uh, a good uh, pry bar, lady finger, whatever it is you're used to calling these things. I picked this one up at Walmart. It's a hyper tough. Uh, I, I would also suggest a long crowbar as well. Uh, I don't have one of those yet. I'm still working on my kit here. A good chisel. You don't never know. Sometimes a good chisel might come in handy. I had it in the drawer there. I thought I would uh, show that as well. A good hammer. This is a DeWalt hammer. This is uh, something you could use to stick in a door jam, possibly get, get access to possible supplies. A good steel handled hatchet or an axe would be better. I don't have an axe yet. But something you could use to, you know, break glass, uh, jam it in the doorway, jam a door open. Here's another, just a thing to break glass with. Uh, a torch, you know. You don't never know what's going to affect your, your personal survival. And I wanted to bring this uh, to y'all today. Again, not unless you're starving to death. Uh... You know, follow all state and local laws and federal laws. Uh, but you don't never know what you might need to affect your survival in a long-term survival situation. That's what we have for you today. Y'all be good. Prep up. FSP out.